In this video, I'm going to teach you how to connect Samsung Odyssey G7 to PC. It's a very easy process, so make sure to follow along. In this video, I'm going to give you easy to follow instructions on how to set up and connect your Odyssey G7 monitor. So you will be able to do this by using either an HDMI or DisplayPort cable. You can choose whichever one you prefer. I would recommend using DisplayPort. Usually DisplayPort allows you to achieve even higher refresh rates on the native resolution for this monitor. So in my opinion, DP is going to be the best. However, HDMI is perfectly suitable as well and you can choose whichever one you prefer. Usually there will be a cable included with these monitors. So when you unbox it, just grab the included cable and that should be enough. However, you can buy them separately to make sure that you get a higher quality cable. Next, make sure that you plug the power adapter into a power outlet. So this will be a power brick, you plug it into a power outlet and then you plug the other end into the Odyssey G7. Once this power brick has been connected, you will be able to set up the cable. So if you look at the back of your monitor, usually you will be able to find display ports in and then HDMI in. You will be able to use any of these. So plug one end of your respective cable into this port and then the other end of the cable should go into your GPU. You will notice that if you look at your motherboard, you can usually find HDMI or maybe DisplayPort cables. Do not use this port. It is always best to connect the HDMI or DisplayPort into your GPU. So usually it is going to be this metal backplate where you can find plenty of different ports available. You can use any of these. This is very important. Make sure that you plug the cable into your graphics card and not your motherboard. And as long as you do it like this, you are going to ensure that you are able to get the maximum resolution and refresh rate possible. If you do not have a dedicated GPU, then you can use the one on your motherboard. But if you have a GPU with ports available, use them instead. I hope I was able to help you on how to connect Samsung Odyssey G7 monitor to PC. If this video helped you, please be sure to leave a like and subscribe for more very easy tips. Thank you for watching.